Coach Ledbetter. And today we're going to talk a little bit about the first step stridling. And this is, if you have a young athlete that you're working with at home, this is very crucial because that might be a key to actually getting them faster pretty quick. When I say pretty quick, I mean time-wise, like weeks, get them faster as quick as possible. If your athlete is sprinting and his first steps are choppy, 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 all right, and he's running just choppy, choppy, if he runs his 10-yard sprint in, say, 10 steps, 9 steps, or 8 steps, we need to be running it in 6, this is what we do. So we put out obstacles for the athlete to step over, okay? So, A, if he's running choppy, he's not going to step over the obstacles. He's going to step on them. That's going to be a key indicator. But nine times out of ten, that visual will make him step over. So it's going to be like this. We have a three-point stance. If I put my left leg forward, then the first obstacle needs to be on the right. Watch our athlete run. I'm the coach, he's the athlete. Go. <coughs> Get over it. Good job. 